position? My position is what the Quran and Sunnah teaches. Bruh. Uh, the well, uh, which is what? <laughs> hey, yo, man. See, this is why we call him Takiyah Track Stars. He's putting on a full display for the Muslim folks in the chat, in the comments. Hey, this is what you got to do to run. You sing boat on the track. The argument is that you contradict when you say that he has attributes that are dependent. Do you believe that the attributes are self-existent or they, do they depend upon Allah's essence and amongst themselves in a dependence relationship? Okay, I'll let you respond to this uh, Muslim answer question. Uh, 30 seconds to respond. Uh, yeah, he mentioned something about uh, uh, the color being a part. I, did, I mentioned many attributes like love and hate and this and that. So that's, that is a straw man. Uh, I, I, I are they dependent? Is it a dependence now, relationship? To respond to the, the dependence or not dependence, we don't use this terminology. Allah doesn't use it, so I therefore I don't use it. I believe it's an attribute, and an and attribute exists within the, the, the creator. We don't use the term dependent or independent to them. Bruh. Are they distinct? What do you mean by distinct? And by the way, suddenly Lantern doesn't know what distinct or depend means. Hey, yo, shout out to Debate Analyzer, y'all. Debate Analyzer, this is a small channel. I think he's just up and coming, or she, whoever it may be. Hey, this is amazing right here. Got the breakdown of what's happening so people that are just tuning in can follow, especially since this is just a clip. Bravo, debate analyzer, go sub, go follow. This is fire. Crimson chin, crimson chin profile pic. So that's how you know who it is. But if you have not seen the full debate, y'all need to go check that out because it was real bad for Muslim Lantern. It was not good at all. We can already see it in the first. We ain't even make it a minute into this video yet. We already see that Muslim Lantern is playing dumb, acting like he doesn't know what's going on. And throughout the entirety of the debate, this is how it was. He wanted to ask his questions and make sure he got answers and responded. But when it came to what Jay Dyer was trying to ask and whatnot, he acted like he didn't know anything. He kept deflecting, contradicting himself, would go back and forth with this is on what this means. And then he'll use it later on. I don't know what this means. Uses that later on. So, you know, it was, it was tough. It was tough for Muslim Lantern in this. Again, if you're a Muslim, yeah, just don't watch. Don't watch social media for a long time, man, because it's not looking good for any of y'all. Not looking good for any of y'all. Muslim Lantern, Hamza, John Fontaine, Rumsey, Cowboy, Muslim Cowboy, Central, none of them. It's not looking good. Y'all just need to go head on and, and, and just lay low for a little bit because it's, it's been a cook session. Let's get back to the video. Again, shout out to Debate Analyzer for this i love what's going on here he is using his favorite debate tactic that he used the entire debate where he asks for a definition or forces you to ask the question in a different way which actually worked and is why jay changed to this thing this way he forces you to change expression to find loopholes in your language or attack it from a different narrative to make a counter argument against a word that is weaker that do not express what the original word does depend or distinct you, you do what do you, you do use that brand? terminology in debates because jake used that terminology in many of i'm not debates. jake we don't use the term dependent or independent i'm not jake i know but you but you're saying you, you guys don't use that terminology he did we don't use the term dependent or independent i'm talking about the from an islamic position you're not allowed to talk uh -huh. about a lot so first he says the argument can't be made because we muslims don't use that word dependence or not dependence we don't use this terminology allah doesn't use it so I don't, therefore i don't use it we don't use the term dependent or independent and when the christians proves muslims do then he changes to i personally don't you, you, you do, do you, you do mean, use that right? terminology in debates because jake used that terminology in many i'm not debates. jake but <laughs> see see this man again shout out to debate analyzer so you see what's going on here. Switch it up real fast when he got caught. When he was saying that, oh, this is not what we do. Not saying him. This is not what we do. This ain't the terminology that Muslims use. But yet, it got brought to his attention. He had to flip it real quick. Man, it's tough when you off that script, boy. When you can't follow that script, it's tough for you. And y'all can see it. This is one thing why I love the internet so much. Because when these things are seen in real time, a lot of us can see what's going on. We can see the deflections. We can see the waffling. But for those who may not necessarily be able to, brothers like this and this channel going back and showing how ridiculous it is, showing how much the heretical and Muslim view waffles. And it don't matter whatever heresy it is, whatever nonsense view it is. They all do the same tactics. They all learn from the same people. The deflection, the not answering, the I want to ask you all the questions and then I want to make sure that you know the terms I'm using and you better know the terms I'm using. But yet when it comes to what you're asking me, I don't know. I don't see it. I don't hear it. Kane, 
from 2005, See No Evil, Hear No Evil, that type of stuff. Richard Pryor and uh, Other Boy from See No Evil, Hear No Evil. That's what's going on here. Play Deaf, Dumb, and Blind. Helen Keller to it. Stop it. Stop it. Let's get back to it, though. His argument was that it can't be used against him because Muslims don't use it. Trash. This way, no argument can be used against him. He changes forms like Ben 10. <laughs> hey, yo, shout out. Okay, so I in other words, you have a double, st you have do a double you standard. So what do you mean by that dependence? Notice that he has a double standard to where in his position what do you he's mean allowed by to stay. Lantern is trying to make Jay express the word or question different because he is desperate to find a loophole in his language. But Jay is aware of his debate tactics since doesn't fall for it. I don't have to answer these questions. I don't know the relationship. I didn't say that. We don't use the term dependent or independent to them. I didn't say that. I asked you what that is what you said. You said we don't have to answer that. I asked That's you what, what you, you said. Mean by yeah. I asked you what you mean by dependent. Are they all say? Are they all say? You have to clarify. What do you mean? Are by they all say? Okay, you're not going to define words. How am I going to respond to you? You got to define. Are they self-existent? I'm sorry, you don't know the terms. Are they self-existent? What do you mean by self-existent? Do they exist of themselves? You don't know that word. They exist within the create. As I said to you, they exist. So they're Allah. dependent. They exist with Allah, and there is nothing that exists separate from its attributes. You're making a, 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 Are the a false argument here by trying no, to se separate it's the attributes from the creator. Your Akidas. your Akidas debate this, and you know I don't that. know what, what Akidah is, but, but I don't... You don't know what a school is. It. It's called uh, Akidah, not Akidah. Is there any better evidence the Lantern is willfully plain dumb? Ignore... Willfully plain dumb, y'all. I've had a Muslim come up here and just try to... No, and I don't speak Arabic. I'm trying to say Tafsir. And he tries to school me on how to say tafsir. Like, bro, that's not a part of what we're talking about here. Forget all that. Forget how I say it. I can talk with a, a slang. I can talk with Ebonics. It don't matter. You know what I'm talking about. So that's how an, another way you know that you're losing. When you got to be like, oh, this is not what it is. <laughs> what they try to do is they try to take these little W's. Ain't really no W's, by the way, because you just sound foolish making these arguments and knowing what it is that he's talking about, but still wasting time to try to think of something to actually come back what it is that he's bringing to you because he ain't got nothing you knew what he's talking about off rip you knew stop playing dumb stop it before the crimson chin comes and gets you hit you with that Ugh. takes you to Cincinnati. keep playing around and shout out to this brother right here debate analyzer go follow go sub to this brother right here i'm loving what he's doing every argument and question made against him he just lied and said he doesn't know what the word meant two seconds later says jay didn't pronounce the word correctly which proves he lied just to avoid the argument even though the pronouncement of a word doesn't change anything in a real moderated debate he would have been warned or disqualified like he doesn't this is what they do they pretend that they don't know these are classic debates that they killed each other over the relationship of like, like the Mutazila, the Mutukalaimam, the Salafi, you all do this. Does Allah have an uncreated foot? Okay, so you talked about the Mutazila. Who were the Mutazila? What did they believe? Give me the four the, principles of Mutazila, five principles of the Mutazila. Nor is the question and changes subject. Lantern asked Jay a knowledge question, which doesn't change Jay's argument or point. You made so that whether argument it's the people the who believe in the body parts of Allah or you whether made that it's the argument. Neoplatonist Shia, you, he you won't made that argument. You made an argument. The they have the same position as the Neoplatonist Shia do. That's what you said. So present me what did they believe. You don't even no, know what they believe. You're you not, no, I don't possible. have to define your schools for you. So you, you don't know. What, then you don't so you know. don't have it. It doesn't matter the four principles when you can't answer the question. They didn't believe what you believe. You can't notice he won't answer the question of Allah and the absolute religion. He doesn't know what the word self-existent and Aussie means. You're incorrect about Islamic What's your position? I don't care about that. What's your position? What's your position? My position is what the Quran and Sunnah teaches. Which is what? Hey, yo, man. See, this is why we call him Takiya Track Stars. He's putting on a full display for the Muslim folks in the chat, in the comments. Hey, this is what you got to do to run. You sing boat on the track. This man is running faster than rap guys' lyrics were spit by Eminem. Takiya track star right here. I don't understand how these Muslim folks rock with these people. How blind do you got to be to think that this brother right here, and there's still people that think like, oh yeah, he did good. He he showed Jay Dyer what was up. He showed him, mm-hmm. But yet, there was absolutely nothing he did. Absolutely nothing he did but run all this debate. Again, this is only a clip and we see how much is going on here. We see how much dodging and deflecting. It's like he's learning dodgeball from Peter LaFleur from the movie Dodgeball. 
You know what I'm saying? Patches of hula hands saying duck, dive, dip, dodge, duck, and, and dive or dodge. However that went. Y'all know what I'm trying to say, though. Ducking. Ducking. Takiya track star 101 right here. This brother needs to write a book about it because, hey, it's going to sell. The Muslims going to pick that up like hotcakes, boy. Bro, this is tough. What's your position? Yeah, What's your position? My position is what the Quran is on the so so you're, What question? I'm, you got to give me a question and then I got to respond to it. So What is the relationship position? of Allah to his attributes? Are they are they say or not? I responded to you. We, we, no, you every human being knows. No, you didn't. You're deflecting and you're, you're Every human being knows the attribute is not separated. Everyone knows this. No, they don't. The you're saying that you're, you're saying your being. schools don't debate this. I, this is a problem. You don't even know what my schools believe. You don't even know. It doesn't matter what. Do, it doesn't matter. Maybe I don't know anything. Maybe I don't know anything. Exactly. Don't know anything. That's a fallacy. That doesn't prove your position. Okay. Sure, you don't know anything. So you're a fallacy, fallacy machine. All right. Thank you very much. So you can't okay. answer this you basic a, question, can you? You don't what know the relationship question? of Allah to his attributes for the fourth what? time? I responded to you. What do you mean <laughs> by that? <laughs> the you deflected. I told you the attributes of Allah are not something that we say is apart or separated from Allah. We don't believe okay. that. We believe How every... The just like so I are exist. They, are they awesome? Just like you cannot separate my love and hate from me. Uh, but those are parts of Allah, you. Sorry? That, These that, are not but, parts. These are attributes. Like that's ridiculous. I thought it's, it's nothing not like creatures. A part is something... Again, you, you, see, like you said it's a part. So it shows that you are saying attributes are part. And you, you said the parts, no, you, you can't you understand that. that I'm putting now you into a personal body. Like a kid, like a child. You just... Boy, I tell you what. That's another thing I don't like, man. I know you're not supposed to do ad homs and stuff like that, but if I'm making fun of you because I'm cooking you, that should be allowed in every debate. Every debate. If I'm giving you the business because you don't know how to defend it, you don't know what you're, what you're doing, I, I'm walking you into a trap, or I'm just blatantly showing you how ridiculous you are, you shouldn't, it should not be an issue for me to call you dumb, call you a numpty, to key a track star. Whatever you got to do, whatever I got to say, to let you know and let the people know, hey, I'm at an insult to injury. Like Larry Bird. Larry Bird, when he came into the three-point contest, he said, hey, yo, who's coming in second place? Why can't there be trash talk like that? We we should have trash talk like this in the debates, especially debates, all debates, but like with this brother right here, Sneeko, I'm, I'm, I'm talking mad stuff while I'm cooking. Mad stuff. Like what? Like I'm about to play this whole, this whole debate speaking backwards and still cook you son still cook you because that's what's going on right here that's what's going on so say what you got to say say what you want to say now he's going to cry about that and harp on that say oh you talking about me da, 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 da. answer the question yo answer the question the hard hidden questions the questions that muslims can't answer anybody in the comments answer these questions how is allah if you believe in the school of thought akita or aikido whatever it is if you believe in the school of thought why in the world, why in the world, if you believe that Allah is nothing like creation, how would you ever know anything about him if he's nothing like creation? He got two hands, two right hands, a shin, but it's nothing like any shin that we have. Then we won't know what a shin is. We don't know what his shin is, so you shouldn't be comparing it to his shin. His attributes, you say he's the most loving. How would you know he's the most loving if we can't compare that and we have love? Don't make no sense. This is so many issues. With the Islamic faith, they don't understand it. But what they love to hold on to is, oh, man, we just read our books and that's it. Like this brother tried to say, but that's not it. That's why they have arguments. And this is exactly what, in the beginning of the video, Jay Dyer was talking about. Because they don't have sound doctrine. They don't have sound theology. And it's definitely not logical at all. So your ignorance. Attributes are not parts. Human beings have attributes. That's because your position. Hit. Hate, you cannot separate hate and love you from an individual. You contradicted yourself and, when you and compared the it to you do, parts of your shirt. The problem dude. you're doing that is because you know the Trinity. Because you know the Trinity is polytheism. You know the Trinity is that th now, now I go back to the Dawah Now let me go back to the Dawah Spirit. Who have, who have, who have independent minds, you have 99 independent gods. existences, independent wells. They're separate from one oh, another. So now you're trying to compare that. Now you know what Asa means. So this guy's a snake, but he knows what the word Asa means. He pretended like he didn't know earlier. And you're trying to compare that to attributes because you have a problem with polytheism. We don't believe in Jesus worshiping. When you have Jesus worshiping, they're not independent. That's not our position. Bowing down and prostrating to him. That's not an attribute of an individual. You don't even know. You, have, know what, I you have the, this, you have the Father you commanding the Holy Spirit. We have the Son commanding the Holy Spirit. That's all he does. That's monarchical Trinitarianism. That's so, the position uh, I gave you. The you're really losing it and acting like a child. And I think you got to relax. No, because you're, you're saying this again. because you literally didn't answer any of the questions I asked you about the attributes. You said parts like shirts. 
shirts have parts, dude. I that's didn't say your shirts. Analogy. I said black. Yeah, I think you're deaf. You can't that's hear. Part of it. You black. don't think shirt? You don't, so blackness is black. not part of your shirt? Uh, show me the existence of black. Where is that? Bruh. That's wild. Sub to debate analyzer, y'all. Yo, man, shout out to debate analyzer for this clip of the Jay Dyer versus Muslim Lantern. And we seen what it was. It was bad from the jump. And how it ended, it was bad. The entire debate was like that. It was rough. A lot of running. That brother Muslim Lantern was tired at the end. Tough. Tough. He was running marathons, running sprints, running decathlons, doing everything he could to run around answering the questions. That's what was going on throughout the entirety of it. With that being said, you see the ticker. It's been going down below some of the time. You're looking at it right now. You might as well go ahead on the like, subscribe to Vibe Out with your boy. And in doing so, hit that noti bell so you can be notified anytime I drop these pre-recorded reactions, live reactions, or have somebody come on and share their testimony. If you'd like to, you can come on and share your testimony as well on my channel. Spreading the truth, spreading the love of God, the gospel here. That's what we're trying to do. Learn about the truth. Learn about who God truly is. That being said, this is your boy, Scripture Club Galbert. I'm going to catch y'all next time. I'm out.